<laughs> Hello, everybody, and welcome back to the Binding of Isaac. Afterbirth Plus. It's been... First and foremost, one week since you looked at me. Let's look at this calendar here real quick. It is May the 3rd. Sp spoilers. It has been... One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine and a half months since I've said that intro. Welcome to Afterbirth Plus, Volume 2. This is going to be Volume 2. It's going to be a separate playlist because I don't want people to have to watch 200 episodes to catch up to what this is. If you want to watch that other episode or the other episodes, it's fine. Blah, blah, blah. No one cares. Let's jump in to not the cane run, of course. Everything's done, but there's a character here that we get to play as now. And I'm excited. I'm not playing as on the file that we played on the stream. This is my original, actual Afterbirth Plus file from the series, I believe, is file one. And, uh... Yeah, we don't have anything done with him. I turned off my no pop-ups mod. I'll have to turn it off in the menu as well, correct? Yes, pop-ups on so that I can tell if things are unlocked. Because that's important. It's been a minute and 40 seconds. Let's just jump into a run. Let's play as the Forgotten. Let's jump into a run, everybody. How are you guys doing? Are you excited? Curse of the Blind. Wait, Curse of the Blind means I can't see my health? I disagree with this. Robo Baby, that's not going to help us very much. Wait, Curse of the Blind doesn't mean that I don't get to see my HP. What? Curse of the Blind is uh, items. What are you talking about, game? Are you on drugs? Are there drugs right now? What is going on? Why can't I see my HP? So if you don't know who the Forgotten is, if for some reason you've been living under a rock for the past three days, it's the new character. It's the new fancy schmancy Afterbirth Plus character that was added in Booster Pack 5. There's tons of new content uh, available. Ooh, available in the game. New rooms, new boss, new character. I think there's like 20 new items, like 20 new items or 10 new items, some kind of amount of items. And on top of that, um, there is also oh, Jesus. There is also new unlocks, which, you know, are some of the items, of course. There's, like, a whole bunch of new stuff, man. whole bunch of new stuff. That's Speedball. That's one-third spun. Oh, my God. Two things. First and foremost, getting back into Afterbirth Plus for the first time in a long time. I don't have to turn on that HUD. That's just there. It's just there. Also, am I the stupidest man? Well, first and foremost, there's your seed. Well, I mean, yes, I am the stupidest man. Let's minimize the game real quick. Can I open this real quick? That is not the seed at all. Don't listen to that. Afterward plus. 60 frames a second. Copies from black. Yeah, that's cool. Save. NC2G 9GPP. Yes, the seed is here. The seed is now. Enjoy the... Ooh, well, that was unfortunate. I still have no health. I don't... I don't know how to feel about this, considering the fact that I'm pretty sure I'm supposed to have, like, bone hearts or some shit. I'm supposed to have bone hearts, though. I don't know if I broke the character. I probably broke the character of some in somehow, in some way, shape and or form. This guy explodes, so I'm gonna try and do a little bone boy. Yo! Nope. Robo baby. Robo baby, come on, baby. Here he is. There he is. No bombs, though. Actual zero bombs. An interesting run so far. Yeah, I have no health. I have no. Yeah, I have zero health. I don't know what's happening here. I actually don't know what's happening. It's not even like a. Penta's just, you know, making us believe he doesn't know what's happening. I actually don't know what's happening. I'm supposed to have health. Equaz. You're supposed to have health. You're supposed to have, like, bone hearts as this boy. And yet there are no bone hearts. 
I'm excited about Rune Bag. I'm disenchanted to use to not use the verb too lightly, of course. That's pretty decent, I guess, in a way. I'm disenchanted with the fact that there is zero HP going on right now. This is the happiest ghost you've ever seen. Look at that ghost face. Tell me that he's not the happiest ghost. He could not be happier. It's the happiest sir. Uh, now, can I cheese? I mean, for, you can always cheese. But can I? Wow, that's right. We have the little larvae. Gotta break all these poops, man. I forgot we just literally just picked up little... Ah! Just picked up little larvae, and yet I forgot about it. Immediately. That's why you watch me. Yeah, I picked up HP, but apparently don't have it, because... Curse of the Blind... Whoa! Damn it, I guess I can. I can take it. The pact works with this boy. Become the biggest ghost. Become the actual biggest... I got a transformation? Oh, I got Stompy! Of course I got Stompy from that. Stompy's a transformation, guys. I didn't forget that Stompy was a transformation. I'm the biggest dude. I can't be stopped. Is there poop? There is poop. Get those... That's such a good drop there. I've been on the first floor for four minutes. Let's, uh... This is not the first floor. This is cellar two. Of course it is. Dude, the pact, though. Well, I mean... Looks like we're gonna be fighting Blighted Ovum in, uh... <laughs> in... Afterbirth Plus as well. That's a, that's a joke for those that are... First and foremost, my name is Penta Hybrid. If you're new to the channel, my name is Penta. Hope you enjoy the content. Subscribe to the channel if you enjoy it. Blah, blah, blah. Typical YouTuber bullshit. Uh... <laughs> but... That's a, that's a joke to the Anti-Birth series that I recently was had been doing for like 100 episodes or something like that, where we just consistently always got uh, bladed ovum on our floors. Okay, so there's clearly still no health on this character. I, uh, I think I'm bugged. Because he's supposed to have health. He's supposed to have like bone hearts or some shit. But there are no bone hearts to be seen. For those that don't know what Lil Larvae does, he turns every poop you hit into a blue fly, which is very good. It's like a cheap guppy's head. I'm just disappointed in the fact that... First and foremost, we get all of our curse rooms for free. Again! Oh, he's flying. That's why we get him for the first hit. He's flying, you idiot. That was dumb. That was dumb. I'm drowsy is good, but it's not gonna do anything because we are we. Because we. I mean that one will. So if you don't know this character, he's a melee character. Uh, imagine the bullet from Gungeon, except incredibly strong and synergizes with 90% of the things. That's like two-thirds spun already. Tears upgrade. Damage upgrade. I'm excited about it. Don't care about any of that stuff in there. I would like... Like, actually, genuinely would like some kind of HP. And by that, I mean I would like to be able to see my HP, if it's possible. Our skeleton looks very strange now. I'm not sure how to feel about his face. Hmm. It's a face only a mother would love? That's not even a face. My mom, if I had that face, my mom would have disowned my ass. She'd have been like, dude, you're you're the ugliest shit in the world, Penta. I don't even, I don't even love you. And I'd be like, mom, but I'm your boy. And then she would have still disowned me because I look like this. Petro. Use this. The gal is... Penta? He still pronounces the pills wrong. He also called those pills. Doesn't he know those are called runes? Has this guy ever played Isaac before? Nah, you're, you're actually on the right track. I've never played this game. I actually don't even know what Isaac is. I thought Isaac was an operating system on Windows. Okay, now there's just no keys. Little Larvae doing some wonderful work for us here. Very underrated trinket. A lot 
of money too, so we're gonna wanna hit up the shop, except for the fact that we don't have gays. You were designed for this, my friend. Dude, the, the bombs though, like that's cool and all, but first and foremost cool and the gang. Can I get an amen? You would have laughed if I took damage there, wouldn't you have? Yeah, you would have. I'm taking fire mind. Because I don't know how it works with the dude. It doesn't turn his bone on fire. It would have been, ooh, it would have been too cool if it turned his bone on fire. Fuck. We also have the pact, which I don't know if that affects this guy. It definitely will affect the ghost, but I don't know if it affects this guy. Hey, Faz. Perthrow's look amazing, but I can't go anywhere. The seek room is probably here. It's a lot of luck. Use all the bombs. Please, come on. Not a single key. There's not a single key anywhere. Don't Keys don't exist, I guess. Cool. <laughs> I mean... Alright. Like, Penta, why didn't you use Perthro on the Fire Mind? Because now we have a ghost that does this shit. We have the strongest ghost. Could've bombed that Tinted Rock, but you know what? I think we're fine. I think we're fine. That's unfortunate. The flies, man. They nearly ended my life. How did I not, for the life of me, get a single fucking bomb? And by bomb, I mean key. Clearly. I mean... Per throw that into that sinus infection, which is interesting. I don't know if that works with the uh... amnesia is great, by the way. It's just like the best pill. I don't know if amnesia works, or if I don't know if sinus infection works with this guy. Also, we don't know what Stompy does. Don't worry, no one knows what Stompy does. Uh, it gives you a cute little trail of cracks behind you and you'll occasionally get the wait what effect upon taking damage and I do mean occasionally blank rune is good X lax is one of those kinds of kinds of useless things it does synergize with his bone he does turn things on fire when he hits them I'm excited about that you know, I'm not excited about literally everything else about this run right now. There's nothing good about this run right now. Not even those stone chests are good right now. We died. Of course we died. Because it's fucking... We don't have HP. Why don't we have health? Excuse you? Wait, why are these on? Why are these on? None of this should be on except for that. I'm going to close the game and open it again real quick. Why were those mods on? Was I... Oh, that's right. Never mind. Launching the doggo. This should work. Go. Please have health. Okay, we have health now. That's awesome. Still Curse of the Blind, but we have health, which is what we need, because apparently I was not allowed to have health before. Spectral... T oh my god, look at that guy's face. Look at his face! Hey, That's the Tim Allen if I've ever seen one. Peanut butter jelly and a baseball bat. Get screwed on cheese tits. I don't have a little, little larva anymore. A little disappointed about that. It's okay. We actually got a key. 
That room was that r run was doomed. By the way, it was doomed. There's a key in there as well. Fuck! I knew that was gonna happen as soon as I saw it. Look, we all knew that was gonna happen. Yeah. I did go to the item room. I have to remember those things. Did not get hit there, like a boss. I did get hit there like a nog boss. Range down is wonderful. Wooden spoon is also wonderful. I'm just going to leave. I don't want to be on this floor right now. I don't want to lose our bone tier. And by bone tier, I mean bone heart. <laughs> so I've been told this also works. But people have lied to me already. Yeah, that does not work. You liars. You bunch of sausages. He's a little penta, don't you realize that the boomerang also works? And I'm like, I tried that on the stream and it didn't work. And they're like, no, you did it wrong. It's like, come on, guys. You bunch of freaking trolls. It's like, I get it. I troll you, you troll back. That's that's the way the world works. I get it. Don't lose the bone tier. Like, the, like that's goal number one is don't lose the bone tier. You can't afford to lose it. Because you can't, those are, the bone tiers are exactly what you might imagine them as. They're, they're like pseudo soul hearts. They're fit, they're like soul heart combined with red heart, which is interesting. Because inside of that, the bone tier is a, it, oh, is a red heart that is, you know, worth two hits. However, outside of it is the bone, and the bone disappears once it takes enough damage, or once it takes another hit. So it, it's three hits missing. I gotta remember that this guy's got the boomerang thing. Or he's got the like Zet Link, where he can just like whip and take stuff. Whip and take was my nickname in high school, by the way. Dude, like this is like insanely good. But I'm gonna get this. I'm gonna get this. I'm gonna do this. I'm gonna do this. Because this is floor two. This is the story of a girl. Cried a river and drawn the whole world. I do want to go back in there and try and reroll for one more soul heart, please. As much as I love Mom's box. There we go. Because now I could take a devil deal if I want. And you gotta remember this is AB, so devil deals are at least. Oh. At least. I did not lose my devil deal chance from that. I do want that heart, but I did not lose my deal chance. Interesting. Mm. I'm not sure. Not sure if he can lose deal chance. I mean, that Bolitar makes our skeleton look exactly awesome, but also is a very good item, by the way. Bolitar is really good. Like, take the heart, dude. You frickin' dumbest. Dumbest Scott Pachesius. What are we doing? It's Monstro. We know Monstro. Probably the hardest boss in the game, honestly. There we go. Tears up is wonderful. Those are both bad. So we're going to move on. Hopefully you guys are playing along with me on the seed, which is very cool because it's four letters and four numbers, which both worries and excites me. I don't like the symmetry there. I mean, I both do like and dislike the symmetry there is what I'm trying to say. I mean, well, this, clearly. That's the right decision. <laughs> what am I? Why am I risking the biscuit when I can just whip the whip the biscuit and put it in my dong? Like that's all I gotta do. He is a little strong, and we talked about this. 
in the Discord. If you're not in my Discord, join my goddamn Discord, you bastards. And we talked about this in the Discord, but like people were like, Fento, now that you've played as the new character, what are your opinions on him? I'm like, well, I gotta play as him more than once. This is only my technically third run as the as the Forgotten. I haven't played as him a whole ton, so I do need to play as him a bit more before I give my full evaluation on him as a character. I do enjoy the character. I think he's a little strong. That's not saying he needs a nerf, Tyrone. I'm just saying that I think he might start very strong, kind of like an Azazel style thing, where he starts really strong. Metal Plate, if I remember correctly, is a Soul Heart. It is, and I don't remember its other effects because it was a dumb item. I think it occasionally deflects damage, but I'm probably wrong on that. I do... Fuck. I do... Gotta learn my distance on this melee attack. It feels like it's longer than it is. It also feels like the first time. I gotta remember I have Ghost Boy. This is... I'm whipping, whipping things. Like, that would have been a perfect opportunity to use Ghost Boy in that other room that had the chest out of my reach instead of walking through the spikes like a doofus. But you know what? We walked through the spikes like a doofus and survived. We're champions. You cannot touch me. Also, can't touch this. Boom, 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 boom. Whoa, oh, 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 whoa. That's not at all on key or the song. Both of those were failures, and I apologize to MC Hammer and the uh, media corporation that owns that song. Because, let's be honest, it's probably not MC Hammer's song anymore. Fox News probably owns it or something. Shoot at me. Shoot at me. There you go. Shoot at me. Shoot at me. Why Fox News? Why not Fox News, really? There you go. So there's our shop arena, if we wish to do so. Already been to the shop? No, we haven't. Don't lie to the people. Mm -mm -mm. That was a room I should have been hit on. Knowing myself, absolutely you should have been hit on that room. I was the luckiest boy. Okay, clearly the range is not what I'm thinking it is here. Oh, the people free my soul. Wanna get lost in the rock and roll and drift away. Go to the item room. You can sing Uncle Cracker until the break of... Fuck. Until the break of dawn, but do not skip the item rooms. This guy is immune to all damage. It's good to know. Also, if you could just, yeah, thank you. And also, yeah, oh, yeah, got him. Magic mushroom. Many donkas. Magic mushroom and item room. This is why you don't skip item rooms, guys. Coming from the guy who just had a lectured another uh, Isaac you know, familiar personality on the usefulness of sometimes skipping item rooms. Two hits for gi well, two hits for Giant Boy, that was so good. Also this, and potentially the bomb, but I'm just gonna probably buy nothing and leave. I don't want to go to the, sa uh, the uh, sacrifice room, the, uh, The way the uh, challenge room. I don't want to go to the challenge room. I do want. Oh, that's not spun though. Yeah, we'll take it though, since it's damage. Now, this character is a highly damage over tears kind of character. Fuck. And then immediately I'm gonna take this and lose my devil deal chance because I do. After the run that I had. On stream, you guys probably watched the video, let's be honest, you probably did. If you didn't, go watch it. Uh, after the run on stream, I did realize the value of the hearts themselves. Because I, I played myself down to the bone, and I do mean that as a pun, of course. Because uh, the character is a skeleton. Uh, I played myself down to the bone to, like, one heart or some shit. 
and it was kind of bad. I mean, the run was still amazing, but it was kind of bad because, I mean, that's amazing as well. Because I had to keep, you know, switching out after the, the last, basically, the last part of the run was incredibly tense. That was incredible. That was incredible. The plays right now. The actual plays right now. Because you got to realize that this guy is like a pseudo-Bethany from Anti-Birth, where he can, oh, he can get hit without losing his Devil Deal chance, but it's only in ghost form that I understand. Those ones are not allowed to be real. I want to talk about the fact that those guys exist now. Spider Mod is really good. Uh, those guys exist now, which is incredibly frustrating to me because I'm bad at this game. The guys that are. This is a new room. The ones that shoot out into the quad shots. Oh, God damn it. The ones that shoot out into the quad shots. I got the item room right. Yeah, it was Doctor's Remote. The ones that shoot out into quad shots are a thing now. Really, the frail? You're gonna give me the goddamn frail and dongle. Really? And we're like really strong, which is like a nice thing. I'm just gonna max out our HP. And then we're obviously gonna take Death Touch. We're gonna obviously take Death Touch. Does Death Touch not? It doesn't affect our scythe. I'm slightly upset about that. I gotta be honest. Like, Death Touch should definitely turn your freaking bone into a scythe. At least when you throw it. Come on, game. I do have the map. I'm just gonna use the world card and take the devil card. Because the devil card's good. I mean, it's kind of pointless to come in here. I don't want to skip the item room as much as I probably could afford to right now. 558 damage per hit right now is insane. Like, beyond controllably insane. Like, we should be criminalized for how much damage we're doing right now. Still mad. Book of Shadows is like really good. Still incredibly upset about the fact that Death Touch is not a thing here. That's frustrating. We can take the one that's on sale. It's Dull Razor, really good, but not what we want. Honestly, this is what we want. I will eventually have to pay our donation machine back, that's for sure. But for now, we're just gonna... I mean, we're definitely going back to the shop now. Buying that other expensive item. Hopefully it's like, something good. Wait, more options, we already had, oh no, we had theirs options. Oh, that's like a perfect item to get at the end of the run. I forgot, I had theirs options. Which is the boss item one. Now I have more options, which is hilarious, because we just got our last item room recently. I took two hits there. He's a brave boy. Emperor is really good. Emperor is like really good because we can we can steal from boss rush using this now There's no reason to go in this room There's like actually no reason to be in here I got a key out of it I thought for some reason that my map was telling me to go this way and clearly It's because they wrapped around on each other that I misread the map arena Thank you 
Thank you. I've gotten better at that room, that's for sure. You can definitely tell that the swing is more powerful considering that that just did a sizable amount of damage less. Thank you, Spider Mod, honestly. And we fought the chest last time, but I do want to know what the item we get there is. Uh, and we're just going to go real heroes go left. Big Chubby's fine, honestly. Steal the boss rush. I'm just going to do boss rush. I can't do boss rush. That's okay. We could have done boss rush, but you know what? We're already at 30 minutes on the womb after failing a couple runs. It's all good. That's right. These are a thing now. Strength card is real good. I will not lie. You ruiner. What a dick. I kind of knew that was going to happen. In fact, I like more than knew that was going to happen. But I'm upset about the fact that it did happen. And I'm allowed to be upset about the fact that it happened. And that's a high priestess. is definitely not good. It's comical because of the character we're playing as right now. This is the character that uh, spawns a bunch of mom's feet when you're doing the unlocks. Spoilers. Oh, come down. Thank you. That's really good. Why? Like, on what Earth was that a smart idea? It had to be a different Earth, for sure, because it's definitely not a smart idea on this Earth. That is a garbage room. It appears to be. Okay. Okay. Gonna go into the boss fight. Daddy long legs, not a problem. Synth oil is two thirds spun. It's also like the second best syringe in the game. Spider Mod's doing some real work right now. Holy shit, Spider Mod's doing some great stuff. Or is that? No, that's Baltar. Spider Mod, you're also doing a great work. Just want to let you know you're doing great work, but that's Balatar I was giving credit to. <laughs> yeah, left through the big room. It's the dumb idea, but it's the smartest of ideas. I got hit. I still don't know how devil deals work with this character, but clearly they are a thing, I guess. Big Chubby actually saved this room. No jokes. Um. Okay. I don't. I don't understand what happened. And I'm just gonna be okay not knowing what happened. Because I feel if I get told what just happened there and why just a random pink poop spawned, I have a feeling I'll get real mad. So I'm just going to accept the fact that there was just a, was just a pink poop there and I didn't see it. Placenta. Something just randomly shot Death Touch out of me. I don't know what it was, but I'm okay with it. If 
fuck. We already got hit a bunch of times. We might as well just keep getting hit, right? I'll go up. I do want to know what the character unlocks, so I'm going to keep doing this. I wonder if the strength card gets rid of a bone heart. Do you get to keep the bone heart, I wonder? It's like 100% up and right, but because it's 100% up and right, it's definitely not going to be up and right. It's absolutely not going to be up and right because of this reason. Um, I forgot how much these rooms suck when our, our speed isn't even that bad. It was not up and right. I did tell you this. I told you to prepare yourselves. Got a key. All right, so we are going definitely up and r up and left. Real heroes go left. Motherfucker. Kidding me? Oh, I'm so tilted at that one. Okay. Okay, Penta. It's time for you to stop. It was like a hundred percent thought I was gonna get hit there. This city is incredibly dicey right now. Like here's the thing, like he's not even that strong. It really comes down to making sure we don't do dumb things and hitting him when it matters because <laughs> our melee attack is like stupid strong like this is going to probably kill him yeah that, there he goes okay so that's that I do want to test the strength card out but I do don't want to use it because if it doesn't work then we're down a strength card which is a great card to have that's not good, that's not good. That's a new item. Rise of the Book of the Dead. I mean, like, I have to use it because it's new, but... Oh, this is a bad idea. Oh, this is a bad idea. Now we're just going to use the character with the damn... Because, like, the Ghost Boy is, like, basically invincible if we can manage to not take damage. Tech Zero is so good. And that's not Tech Zero, by the way. That's Tech .5. Which is also insanely good, by the way. I'm not discrediting Tech Zero. Tech Point Five is probably better than Tech Zero, let's be honest. Like, actually, now that I'm looking at this run, considering how strong Ghost Boy is, there's no reason we can lose this. I don't want to try that because I'm terrified of it. 
And I think you know exactly what thought process I was going down there. Trying to take Guppy's paw and using it as the Forgotten and maybe turning his bone heart into soul, <laughs> soul hearts. Why would you go in this room when there's no reason to be in here? Yep, there you go. Clever damage there, Penta. Clever damage, as always. That bomb took forever to explode. I do like the chain effect of having to be dragged back to the the Bone Boy. So here's here's one thing I gotta say, just because I know there's gonna be people probably wondering. I don't know what the plans are for the series. If it's gonna be a daily series like the Anti Birth was, I've, that was a spider. Spider mod made him tiny, I guess, because I did not see him. Uh, okay, we did that. That's a thing. That is officially a thing now, I guess. We now have a bunch of bonies fighting for us here. I'm okay with this. I don't know to what extent. <laughs> but yeah, I don't know how long this series, how often this series is going to be. Right now, as of right now, just because we still have we still have Anti-Birth uh, to be released. As, as like When this episode goes up, we still, I believe, have I believe we still have we have a bunch of bones surrounding us now. Okay, there, there are too many questions. A few answers. Uh, and I'm somewhat excited about that, because it's new stuff. But uh, what I'm trying to say is, because we still have like five episodes of Antiburst still left, I don't know what the extent of videos for the Afterbirth Plus is going to look like. I'm guessing it's probably going to be like every other day, or uh, something like that, until Antiburst ends. And as soon as Anti-Birth ends, we're most likely going to go to daily uploads of this instead. We're going to get HP back here anyway, so it's fine. <sighs> like, I did not expect to win this run, considering how lossful our HP was very, very in recent memory, but considering the fact that we're sitting here now two rooms away from victory... I'm, I'm stoked. I gotta say I'm stoked about finding out what the hell we unlock as the Forgotten to the chest. A little disappointed we didn't get to do Bob Ross, but honestly, we probably would have died, so let's be fair. Let's be fair. I mean, we have PhD, so... We have two puberty pills. Puberty. Did we already take a puberty, puberty pill? No, we don't have our adult transformation. Bring it fine. We're gonna pop our strength card on the boss arena. Which I think is pretty obvious that that's our choice. There is something to be said about just standing behind the Forgotten and shooting through him because we have piercing. This might be cheating, cheating but uh, I'm okay with it. Considering, uh, I want to win. I did not consider the fact that... Oh. We are so strong with that melee attack. Holy shit. So Book of the Dead apparently cr creates orbitals and also spawns things behind us. I didn't unlock anything, I guess, as well. Is what I'm noticing. Even with my pop-up animations on, we didn't unlock anything. Anyway, thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, of course, leave a like, subscribe, and share it with all your friends. Tell people that Penta is back in Afterbirth Plus. We're going to probably continue the Forgotten until we complete his post-it note, which, yes, includes greed greedier, greed mode, delirium, all that fun stuff. Good lord. Let's finally 100% the last character in the game again, because we keep adding goddamn characters. I just remember when it was these four characters. And technically, it was just these three characters. <laughs> anyway, we'll see you guys tomorrow or whatever the next episode goes up. Catch you guys later.